So if you have kids, uh, I'm sure you've had to regulate what they uh, watch on TV, all the streaming services, YouTube. Um, so because we always tell them um, you, you can't unsee things, right? Once you see something, you can't unsee it and it's in your head forever and you can't get it out. Um, you know, especially because they have access to these things. A lot of the time when you're not around, uh, you really don't know what they're watching, right? So the same um, goes for what you say, right? Uh, once you say something, you, you can't unsay it, right? You can apologize, apologize all you want. Uh, you can say you didn't mean it. You can say you were in a bad mood. Uh, you can say... Uh, you feel sick, right? You can say all these things, um, but that doesn't unsay what you already said, right? And usually, uh, when we're in situations like that, when we don't feel well, when we're tired, when we're aggravated, usually what we say is the truth, right? It's what we really feel. Uh, and when you when you don't feel that way, um, you're able to filter these things, not say them. It doesn't mean that you shouldn't feel them. Everyone has a right to feel however they want, uh, but you know, when you're when you feel good, when you're rested, when you're not sick, when you're in a good mood, you're able to catch yourself uh, before you say these things. Right? When, once all those things go out the window, uh, you know, the last thing you you think of when you're in that situation is is filtering what you say. Uh, unfortunately, that's when the, the probably the worst things that you say uh, come out of your mouth. And you, know, you let the person next to you, the closest person to you, have it, right? So we should get in the habit of consciously understanding that once something leaves your mouth, uh, you can't take it back. Even if you say, I'm sorry, or, you know, make him dinner, or, you know, buy him something, or do whatever you think in, in your mind that cancels out what you, what you did. Uh, it doesn't, right? You already said it. It's already gone. And uh, the other person can say, you know, it's all right, I understand. Or uh, most of the time they will, they will, um, you know, reply in kind, right? However you talk to them. However you talk to somebody is usually how they talk back to you. Um, so that's it's already out there, right? So you have to consciously think about what you're saying, what leaves your mouth, um, because there, there may come a time where you say something so bad that it really doesn't matter how many sorries you say or how many dinners you buy that it doesn't uh, undo what um, you said. So uh, careful what you say. Uh, just like if you see something horrible on TV, it'll stick with you for you know a long time. Uh, that's fiction, right? The same thing goes for. Uh, non-fiction when you say something uh, that you really shouldn't say that you should keep inside um, because you know you can't unsay uh, what has been said <laughs>